Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the video. So this is what I got in my ultimate pack. I got an ultimate pack from EA. Thank you very much for that. For logging in, I don't know how many days. I usually log in almost every day. And this is what I got. I was pretty happy about getting this. Hernandez wants to watch. It looks pretty insane. But unfortunately, he didn't get an upgrade throughout all, throughout all FIFA 20. Now, boys, if you guys hear any noise at the background, I'm really sorry, but it's my uh, my daughter. She's not gone sleep yet, and it's 10.37, and I'm making this video now. Anyway, what I did next was I was very, very impressed with the look of that Endumbele card. So I end up getting this card. It looks absolutely insane. So I thought, yeah, I'm going to buy it. Another reason why I bought this card, have you seen that card design? It looks so, so good. Like that card design looks absolutely fantastic. So there was no way I was going to turn it down. I also won five matches in Rivals so I could unlock this Mendy. Now, this Christmas Mendy was very expensive when it first came out. And I have to say, even still right now, he's still a very, very good card. Now, four-star skills, three-star weak for phenomenal stats of increased his stats using the gladiator chemistry style now the reason why i chose that is because i feel like shooting and defending is very very pivotal on a central midfielder and i think that looks like a very very complete card and it was a very complete card i used it in rivals and i was royally impressed with this card so i wrote down the strengths and weaknesses on the side i was really happy his agility felt good now because of his height i do want to go over the weaknesses first he was a little bit clunky just us just sometimes you know he doesn't fit into the meta of being five for eight five for nine but i have to say to you guys he made some tearing runs down the center and he reminded me of the great sissoko and the great patrick vieira when he was making them tearing runs in the center would i go for this card absolutely he had amazing attack positioning. He skipped past defenders with his amazing acceleration. He had four-star skills, giving him a very good variety of skills that he could pull off. He had fantastic attack positioning. And of course, he was very, very good at scoring goals. Now, looking at his card, I was very happy that I increased his shooting because his attack positioning and shooting became very, very clinical. Honestly, he got me a hat-trick in this game that really blew me away on how good this card really is. And also, another thing, just whenever he was scoring goals, he was also creating goals. He had fantastic passing, let me tell you. He never, ever misplaced a pass, and that shocked me. Because I tell you what, in this game, passing is horrendous. There are only a select few players who actually have got good passing. And by the way, that was great attack positioning to finish that off. So... Using him as a cam is a very, very viable option. You could do that. I used him as a cam, central mid and CDM. He could play all three roles really, really well. His long shots were really good as well. Definitely had a lot of shot power to them. So a very, very impressive card for two 84 rated teams. I have to say, price is definitely on point for this fantastic looking card. Fantastic design on these summer design cards. So really really impressed impressed now using him as a cdm is another very very good option because he's got fantastic tackling ability he's got really good slide tackles as well fantastic fantastic card one thing i have to say is he will get your opponent frustrated because of the way he attack the way he tackles he's so aggressive the way he tackles and he just gets in there and sometimes you don't, you just, you just can't get away from him. So he's got that size, that presence, good at intercepting as well. Definitely reminds me of a blend of Conte and Sissoko. He really does feel like somebody who fits in between them. And if he wasn't defending or scoring goals, he was assisting. Like I've already said, look at that fantastic pass out there. And this actually creates me a goal. So I'm going to give this card a flat out 9.5. Four out of ten because besides a little bit of clunkiness here and there because of his height and the three star weak foot he was absolutely brilliant he had it all to his game honestly what a card what a card highly recommended fantastic fantastic card thank you very much for watching